My name is Brenda Andrews, part of the 4A Sisters Lupus Foundation here in Lafayette, Louisiana. This evening we want to talk about and pump it up. We have an event coming up September 25th, uh, All American Music Fest. Today we have special guests with us this evening. My brother, Christopher Andrews, better known to many, Uncle Polly. Hello. Special guest, Kenny Neal, the All American Blues singer. Hello, everybody. And of course, my friend, Shelly Terrence. Hello. Yes. So, what are we doing? The Four Edge Sister Club started um, 2011, August 2011. Of course, we had our mother passed away in 1965 of lupus, a disease that no one talks about. And uh, father remarried, mm -hmm. and uh, they were married for 40 something years. She too passed away with lupus. So after that, me and my sister say, we know we need to put the word out and uh, make it aware, you know, awareness. And we have meetings and um, so we're gonna put this event together here in Lafayette and uh, I, th I think it's a great event. Mm -hmm. I really yes. do, I really do. Music normally brings people together and with the music, you could put the idea, the the information out there. So, four A's, great job, great job. Yes. And the talent, you know, Kenny Neal, headlining, it's 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 beautiful. Yeah, and it's always good to have be a part of it and help out because that's important, you know. No, thank you. Yes. So I'm glad to be a part of it. Yes. You're welcome. Yeah. And Lupus, uh, my friend Shelly, um, share a little bit about Lupus. Uh, lupus is a autoimmune disease. What it is is people that as far as your immune your immune disease works for you. With lupus it works against you and as far as people that have lupus the your immune system is fighting and attacking your organs. Right. And right. it's a silent disease because we don't know, a lot of people look at us and they don't see that um, it doesn't show anything. And it could be, there's different types of lupus as well. Um, there's one where, you know, it could be your skin. It's one where you, it, it attacks with the butterfly rash. As far as, you know, you'll get rash on your face, your skin, you can't go out into the sun. Mine is where it attacks the organs and that's another type of um, where I have where it attacks where the lungs or the brain. I have a seizure disorder and uh, my brain is, I, I have seizures. I have where my brain does not tell me to breathe. I have a trach. I also have where I'm starting to have bladder problems, kidney problems. So it's attacking all types of organs. I have RA, rheumatoid arthritis. So there's different, you know, things that goes on where my immune system is saying, you know, it's fighting against me. And your healthy immune system for a normal person, it's fighting for you. Right. And right. on a daily basis, and then another thing, there's different symptoms. The thing about it is it's hard it's also hard to detect um, lupus because there's so many symptoms but the main thing is when you have lupus you you don't the main thing is if you have one symptom such as um, like a cold when you have a cold or a flu you have um, a runny nose or you you're coughing earache fever well those symptoms are symptoms of a cold and you go to the doctors and you tell them you have your symptoms and they'll tell you you have the flu. Well the same thing with lupus. When you start finding out that you have, you know, you go in and you say, well, you know, I'm having some pain or I'm having a lot of fatigue or, you know, I, you, you want to find, you want to get tested when you start finding, okay, I'm having seizures or, you know, you start finding multiple things going on. One of the things to consider is to go ahead and, and and get tested. Now, lupus is something that Brenda and I, you know, we all know. Um, it it attacks now it can attack anyone, but we're finding that it, it does attack 
more mm-hmm. of African. women of African Americans, but women of color. Women of color. Um, and so that's something that we need to um, be aware of. And a lot of people don't know what they have because when you see us on a regular day, you know, we look normal. We look, you know, we could be, you know, anywhere. I mean, besides my trach, I mean, normally I wear a scarf, but looking at me on a normal day basis, you wouldn't know that I have lupus. And so that's something that um, you definitely want to get tested. And we're, we're getting ready, and, and music is such a beautiful way yes, to, yes. to, you know, bring, people bring together, together right. and, mm-hmm. and for our cause. I mean, because that, that's, that's a joy. Music is mm-hmm. such a joy. Yeah. And we don't want to lay down to this disease. We don't, you know, because I know we're tired, we're, you know, we, we're, we're aching a lot, and a lot of people say, hey, you look okay, but they don't feel the pain that we go through or the, the tiredness, you can't get up. Your body just says, I'm done. And um, so you don't want to lay down. You want to get up, get your body circulating. Keep moving. Keep yeah. moving. Yeah. What was the Dance. slogan you said a while ago, Kenny? Yeah, live, live life, life. Let live life flow. Live life, let, live let, life, let life, you know. Flow. Let life flow. Yes, that's and a good, yes. that's a good terminology. And yeah. one thing, music and is. And that's what we're gonna do for gonna everyone who comes with yeah. the uh, who has been diagnosed with lupus and want to know about it. Uh, this function is to let life flow. Let them right. dance to it. Let them enjoy and and definitely get the information. Yes, definitely we have several several musicians that's coming down. We have also Major Handy, local band from the Lafayette area, uh, Jerissa McBride, better known as the Duchess, coming from Vicksburg, Mississippi, uh, Miss Pat Wilder, all the way from California, but to, from Baton Rouge, Louisiana, mm-hmm. and she has a, she plays the guitar, mm-hmm. and a friend of hers coming down also that's a violin, but um, Carol, Fran. Carol, Carol Fran, Fran, the legendary Carol, Carol, Carol Fran is going to be on the list, and also Imani Scott, a uh, young artist from Houston, Texas. But uh, Kenny, so um, I'm so glad you got on board. Oh, I'm, I'm and happy I, to be on board, and I'm looking forward to the future with you all. Thank you, yeah, thank I'm you. Back home in Louisiana, I want to be a part. Very good. Yes. And uh, Kenny, going to try to play a little something for us. Uh, but we have Paulie's going to do some. Yeah. And we're going to do our R and B. We're going to do some blues, and we're going to we're going to bring you know bring some 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 more essence to a, a, a worthwhile cause. Right. You know. Right. And we want everybody to come out and support yeah. this event. Tickets is on sale. My number is 337-258-1666. This event is um, going to be at the Warehouse 535 on Garfield Street in Lafayette, September 25th at 4 p.m., 4 to 8. Yeah. Lots of musicians going to be in the house. And, Brenda, we want to say what the call, why we're doing this and where the proceedings are going Right, to. again, this is a lupus benefit. Uh, the 4A sisters, I'm one of the 4A sisters. It's me, my sister, Gail, Martha, and Anasia. Again, we started this in 2011. Every year we host an event. The funds that are made, we give it back to the community. And uh, last year was a brunch. It was very nice at the Ramada Inn. We had a New Year's bash. We had pool bar sale. But the funds go back. You know, mm-hmm. and uh, everybody that's putting this on in kind service, and we appreciate it. So we want to blow this one up. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And for, uh, for being one of the, uh, if not the first blues fest, she's, it's called All American. All fest, Americans. We have a which, different which genre. Is yes. Genre of yeah. music. You know, uh, it's just something new that the community should get on board with because it's gonna, it's gonna, it's, it's a worthwhile cause. I'm, I'm really, I'm really digging it. You know. Right. I'm really digging it. The, the cause is great. And I, I just want to have to say this. Um, I'm one of the fortunate ones that doesn't have to pay as much with this disease. But there are a lot of people out there. They have multiple different doctors. And it's very costly to have this disease. I mean, they have their medicines. And when I say medicines, they're... They, we call them cocktails, but I mean, you have, I mean, I know with myself, I take like six, seven pills in the morning, and at night it's even worse. I have 12 pills that I take at night, and right now, sometimes it goes up even more. Um, right now, I'm about to have a surgery, and I, 
am taking, I'm, I'm going to say maybe probably about 30 pills right now every day leading up to, to the this surgery. surgery. Yes. So your medications can be very costly. I have a equipment that I use that I'm renting, um, and that's costly. And then just my trach alone, I mean, I pay for my own trach. And I mean, these are just examples, just so you know, that, that, that what costs the expenses of having right. this disease. And for it to be, so, you know, so um, to raise funds and, and give them out to people that have to lupus, use personal to, use to, or to for use bills. for their right. medical bills. Right. I mean, I think this is really a good cause. Oh, definitely, definitely. Right. And um, to give them out to the community yeah. like that well, thank is you. a wonderful thing. Thank you. We do it from the bottom of our heart. Mm -hmm. And uh, we meet the third Thursday of every month at the King Center at 309 Cora Street here in Lafayette at 5 o'clock. And we've been having more and more. A few family members has passed away. Some of the husbands come and listen to the stories, and he look at his wife and say, you know, I thought you was clowning, but listening to all these women, so you really telling the truth. So the husbands are learning also. And the kids have lupus, and men can get lupus also. That's right. Yeah. That's right. But um, Kenny, you want to tell the surrounding area? Because ALC goes far, far away. Yeah. A little history about yourself. Well, I, I'm the eldest of 10 from my family of uh, Baton Rouge. My dad was Rayful. Rayful Neal. Okay. And um, all of my siblings are musicians, which we're going to wow. have the Neal family at this concert. Okay. I'm bringing them all over from Baton Rouge. Wow. Yeah. And I, um, I toured. Um, folks can go over to KennyNeal.net and find out more about the family. But I toured when I first left here in the 70s with Mr. Buddy Guy as a bass player. And I went on to pursue my career and uh, did Broadway and maybe 17 CDs in now. Yes, and I moved back to Louisiana on my turf, and I'm very happy wow. to be back and in, uh, involved with the community. Yeah. Thank you. It's Thank great you. to be home. We appreciate yes. it. And, uh, so let's see what you're working with. Uh. Well, I got a, this, this little guitar um, sits by my bed all the time. I write a lot of songs. Okay. When I was fighting my liver disease, uh, I couldn't get up one morning, you know, halfway through my treatments. Okay. And um, I couldn't get up, and I go, man, just when you think you got it all figured out, here comes something you never dreamed about. And I wrote it down. Okay. And I got better. Uh, after I got better, um, six, seven months later, I went back and saw my notes, and I wrote this song called Let Life Flow on this guitar. Okay. And it got me a couple of Grammy nominations, Song of the Year, CD of the Year. Wow. So awesome. uh, even though in our yes. hard times, we got to think positive Correct. and let life flow and it'll be okay. okay. So I'll do a little bit of it for you. Okay. Thank you. Just when you think you got it all figured out, here comes something you never dreamed about. Life is so unpredictable, y'all.
So and realness. Yeah. That's a little bit of what we're going to be doing. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to blow some mind. It's going to be nice. Indeed. It's going to be so nice. So I think that song was just a message came from the man for me to share with my fans because um, I get emails where they play it at weddings. They play it at funerals. Yes. You know, and it's just, I'm so happy that I had yes. a chance to record how I was really feeling when I was at the worst point of my life. I thought right. I was going to lose my life. And I survived, and here I am. And the hair grew nice. back, and yeah, wow. Had no hair. I never did like dreads. I thought I'd never put <laughs> it. But I, uh, I'm back, and I'm uh, proud to be here. <laughs> you know, Thank Kenny, you. it's so funny when I heard that, and you started playing. My brother put that on for me at my low point. Wow. And wow. I just that heard song. It, that song. Yeah. Let and, life flow. Uh, yes. And he put that on for me. I was in Texas with him, mm -hmm. and he said, you got to hear this. <laughs> yeah. And here it is. I'm hearing it again. It's confirmation. Yeah. confirmation. I almost <laughs> cried, <laughs> I, you know. And I, 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 I wish he was listening right now, but you yeah. hear it. You hear yeah, it. He, he works Good. for a television station. I don't well, know I'm happy to be able how, to share that song. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Well, we're definitely, we're definitely a community of, uh, of givers, Acadiana. Lafayette and surrounding areas. This community, Kenny, is is wonderful when it comes to a worthwhile cause. Right. And I think that lupus, as solid as it is, and as much as my four sisters and yourself is getting the word out, uh, just just everybody who's listening, you know, just if you love some good music and you good down for a good cause, I really think September 25th you should be in the house. Come on out, I'm ready to enjoy it. We yeah. have reserved tables. Um, mm -hmm six at a table if you want or we have four at a table mm -hmm. if you don't want to pick up a ticket you can pay at the door mm -hmm. again all american music fest yes. september 25th at the warehouse 535 on garfield street lafayette louisiana get your tickets now my number is 337-258-1666 i thank all the listening audience for Katie you the love you Thank you, Shelly. Thank you. It's a little hard sometimes, y'all.